Good morning, Mo Wildcats. It is time for our daily announcements. We are from Mr. Johnson's seventh grade homeroom. Uh, today is Thursday, May 4th. Skylar, what are we having for lunch today? Today for lunch, we're having a warm turkey ham and cheese sandwich on a whole grain bun or a prime veggie grilla burger on a whole grain bun and steamed carrots, fresh broccoli, ranch dressing, mayonnaise, apple slices with a caramel packet and a choice of milk. And for tomorrow, we're having chicken and gravy over mashed potatoes or vegetarian chicken nuggets, creamy mashed potatoes and cucumber slices and pe red pepper strips, whole grain pan roll, margarine. Margarine, ranch dressing, sliced pears, local ice cream, and a choice of milk. Eli, what can we expect for the weather today and tomorrow? Today we can expect a low of 46 degrees and a high of 63 degrees. Tomorrow has a low of 46 and a high of 66. Um, we have one birthday, and that's Brooklyn Bell, so happy birthday. And now some announcements from Miss Amy. Good morning, everyone. Uh, first of all, I would just like to thank our wonderful K-4 teacher and students for the lovely May basket with treats in it. We were given those on Monday. Thank you so much students for your hard work and delivery of those May baskets. Hey, today is Star Wars day. Look around you. Do you see anybody in some galaxy clothing or Star Wars t-shirts? Because it is May the 4th and they say may the 4th be with you. All right, moving on. It is also thankful Thursday. I've got some notes I would like to read here. Thank you, Ms. Sarah Schultz, for putting these together for us. Kimora, I'm thankful for you because you are my friend. That's from Brooke. Mr. Govin, I'm thankful for you because you are a great softball coach from Benji. Amari, I'm grateful for you because you are a great and a kind friend. And that's from Laureen. Ms. Quesada, I am thankful for you because you are a really funny teacher and your smile is everything. That's from Amir. Uh, Clarissa, I'm thankful for you and I love you from Ashley. Miss Laura, I am so thankful for you because you work so hard. That's from Miss Kelly. Uh, Janaya, Gianna, and Jakaila, you guys, I'm thankful for you because you make me happy and I enjoy hanging out with you. That's from Kate. I'm thankful for you, Miss Jones, because you help me with my worksheets and I know that you care about me. That is from Simone or daily sheet. That is uh, Khalil. I'm thankful for you because you have great sportsmanship. That is from your secret friend, Miss Melissa. I'm thankful for you because you're an amazing person. That is from Omar. Johnny L. I'm thankful for you because you are funny. And that's from an anonymous friend, Mr. Dunbeck. I'm thankful for you because you are a really good coach. That is from grace. Very good. And hey, let me remind you, our mindset for this month is the time is now. Today's message is called get in the zone. And this is something that definitely shows maturity. We've all had those days where it feels like things are going not our way. It's those times where we need to stop ourselves, figure out what's going on and put ourselves in a better state of mind. Wait, let me read that again. Put ourselves in a better state of mind. So this requires some action on your part. And again, this shows maturity. We want to make sure that our actions truly represent what we're feeling and that we're acting appropriately. So it require, requires you to stop, think, and maybe reframe your thoughts and actions. All right. Thank you for that, for listening to that message, students. And that is our mindset for the month of May. So spotlight for today, Jaden Combs. Jaden, please say hello. Hi. All right, Jaden, you are headed to McDowell Montessori School and you've been at Whitman for three years. You'll definitely miss your friends. And this is great. I was excited to read that your future goal is to be a football coach. That's fantastic. You enjoyed flag football while you were at Whitman. And I see this. I see you have some really nice advice. What would what would and I just want to remind people again, this is Jaden, who is uh, was our uh, student of the year. So that that wow, that reflects a lot of good behavior, good effort and hard work on your part, Jaden. So congrats again. Um, what advice do you have for our younger students, Jaden? Mm, to be good and get good grades. Awesome, that has obviously served you very well. Thank you, I love that advice. So you're vaguely familiar with Box of Lies, I've heard. So we've got a, you know how sometimes they have a pinch hit hitter in baseball? Well, we've got a pinch liar or truth teller. I don't know what she's gonna do, but Natalie is filling in for Jay and so if you will listen to her, she's going to describe something and you, it's up to you to decide if Natalie's lying or telling the truth. You good with that? Yeah. All right. Here she is. All right, Natalie. Okay. 
Can you hear her okay? Yeah. I have a baby with really big arms and some glasses, and his mouth is really open, and he has a necklace. Uh, uh, you, guys, you think it's a lie? Yeah. Natalie was telling the truth. Can you see that, Jaden? Yeah. What? That's a wacky photo. All right, Jaden. So Natalie, on behalf of Jay, has won today. Thank you, Jaden, for being on our announcements. And uh, best wishes to you. And if our announcements, our announcers could close out today's announcements, please. Tune in tomorrow and every day for more Wildcat news. Have a great day when Wildcats will see you around the building. Now, now is the time, time to improve. improve.